Hey, YouTube, that was my finger right there in the corner. But anyway, I am doing a shopping haul today from Big Lots. And also, I went to Rose's to see what I could find for my garden. So join me for happy hour so you can see what I got. Hey, YouTube, and welcome back to my channel, Gardening and Cocktails with Joy. So today we are at the Good Vibes Only Bar, and what we're going to do is we're going to make a fuzzy leprechaun before I show you my shopping haul. So what we're going to do first is for this, did I say blue leprechaun? Fuzzy leprechaun. We're going to make a fuzzy leprechaun. That's the name of the drink. So what we're going to start off with is um, we're going to start off with some pineapple juice. I already got some ice in my shaker here. We're gonna add some orange juice. And we're gonna add some of this blue Kiriko liqueur. And we're gonna add some of that peach schnapps that I used in that fuzzy navel last week. That goes in there. Guess that's the fuzzy part of the leprechaun. So we got the uh, peach knot, the blue Kiriko, and we're going to add some of this Tito's Vodka. I'm not going to add too much. I think that should be good right there. I do not want it too strong. And this is the glass that I'm going to use right here. So we're going to go ahead and fill the glass up with some ice. If I can get it in there. There we go. Okay, now let's go ahead and give this fuzzy leprechaun a good shake here. Make sure this top is on there good. Okay, here we go. That should do it. And we're going to go ahead and give this a pour into our glass. And there we have it. This is the fuzzy leprechaun. So, one other thing that's going to need this, of course, we got to do a little garnish here. So, I have a orange with the maraschino cherry. And there you have it, the fuzzy leprechaun. Let's move this right here. There we go. And that's a pretty drink right there. So let's go ahead and do a taste test. Pinky finger out. Mm, this is so good. The pineapple and the orange. And the blue Kiriko has a little um, orange liqueur flavor to it as well. I didn't put too much vodka in there. I didn't want to overdo it. but it's absolutely delicious. So let's go ahead and put this to the side because I'm gonna finish that up. But I want to show you what I got from Big Lots and Roses today. So we're gonna start with Big Lots first. I picked up some of these Black Eyed Susans. Um, and of course they bloom every year. And these were $3 at Big Lots. Also from Big Lots, I picked up this cute planner, and it says, plant one on me. So I have a perfect plant I'm going to put in there. So I really love that. I'm finding that Big Lots prices are a little higher uh, than what they were last year. I just kind of noticed that. And also, get my haul down here for roses. I picked up some of these shallots, and they were $2. I love to cook with shallots. And also, I picked up a, a rose bush, which was four, $4.49. And um, it has yellow on there. It says sunblast, rich yellow, double flowers. So... Yeah, I wanted to get some yellow roses because that's going to be 
my theme for outside. Uh, yellow flowers, the roses, and all that good stuff. Also from roses, I was able to pick up some some of these pots right here because I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to be doing a lot of container gardening. So I picked up six of these pots right here, and they're pretty good size. You see, you can see that pretty deep. Got a bag in there. They're pretty deep, so I'll be able to drill some holes in here. And these pots were $3. So I got quite a few of them, so I can use them year after year after year. So that's my little shopping haul today. Um, I had a good time getting out, um, looking at different things. I had a really good day. And if anybody's watching, I sure do appreciate you. Happy gardening to you. And y'all have a great evening.